big welcome to you to the London Stadium for our featured game today. Martin Tyler here with Alan Smith. West Ham United. In our game today, West Ham United, and they play Everton. United lineup today, number one, Lucas Fabianski. It's been a good effort, really, by all concerned, to turn what was an athletics arena into a football stadium here in East London, the London Stadium. Great to get the game underway through West Ham's kickoff. West Ham United's lineup is this. I think that back four is really important for them. They've got to be strong and solid, but they've got a bit of protection, haven't they? They have. They should have more than enough. I mean, they're all good defenders in their own rights, but uh, in front of them, they've got players who are going to be working really hard. Whether they could be a threat on the front foot, we'll wait and see. Got the Everton lineup for you. Seamus Coleman starts with Lucas Dini as the wide defenders. And here is just the one main attacker in this lineup. Everton edging forward from this wide area. Put into the middle. Good defensive clearance there. Good screening, and he's kept the ball. Rice. No booking from the referee, just a free kick. Gilfi Sigurdsson. Gay. Winning the target for West Ham United here, but they know it won't be a simple task. Well, that's good defending. Well, that'll be a throw. He could cross it from here, looking for teammates in the middle. Made the save. Well, now they've got the ball, what are they going to do with it? And that will clear the danger. It's gone out for a throw. Bernard. They've gone wide, chance to get the ball in the box. Idrissa Ghana Gay. Has a go here. Reflected behind. A clear corner. Corner played into the middle. Defended well. Andre Gomez. He's got his shot off now. He really gave it the laces there, didn't he, Alan? Yeah, he did connect with it beautifully. Not a bad effort at all. Coleman. Neatly intercepted. Now Andre Gomez. Idrissa Ghana Gay. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. That's a great clearance. Coleman. Zabaleta. Noble. Steered through. Well, it's come to nothing in the end. To Andre Gomez. Gay. Gilfi Sigurdsson. Kurt Zuma. It's a good challenge by West Ham to get the ball back. Rice. Steered through. Going to try one now. And here's the shot. And there it is! It's the kind of goal that forwards love, actually, because it rewards their ability to follow in, their anticipation. Yeah, ends up being... A simple-looking goal, but it wasn't. As you say, it was about anticipation.
West Ham are in the lead. For West Ham United. Number Bernard. 18, Samir Nasri. Gilfie Sigurdsson. Sigurdsson! He's made the save. It's good to know how much longer there is. This wasn't always the case, certainly when I started commentating. Great ball. Played in the clear. Well, he's in the clear, and the goalkeeper has saved it and saved his... So it's 1-0 here as the half-time whistle goes. The second half is off and underway. To Andre Gomez. Gilfie Sigurdsson. West Ham have won that passage of play and come away with the ball. Noble. Angelo Ogbonna. Mark Noble. Marco Arnautovic. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. That's out of danger there with that clearance. Gilfie Sigurdsson. Good vision. Bit of space for him. Now out on the wing. Can he clear his lines now? Mark Noble. Marco Arnautovic. Bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. And Nautovic gets his foot in there. Bernard. It's a good place to win the ball here. Here's a chance to whip it in. Mark Noble. It's with Zabaleta trying to find an opening. Not panicking. Good block, but a poor cross. They pressed well to win the ball back. And now to it. Pass threaded through. It's in! Fine moment for them. They've got a firmer grip on the game now. They're two ahead. Goalkeeper was reaching for it, and it did actually touch him on the way in. I think there was just too much power on the ball, on the shot, for him to get a strong enough touch just widen the margin here to 2-0 Coleman Number 16, it's going to be a change Norman. for West Ham coming up Gilfie Sigurdsson had a crack well it wasn't a guilt edge chance but it was really an opportunity for them to start finding their way back into the game yeah, and they mustn't let hedge drop because they still have got a decent chance in this match Diop and 20 minutes to go Idrissa Ghana Gay attacking well here Oh, well, now that's a corner, Everton's way. Well, they haven't had much to shout about. Desperately need something to happen here, though, or else I can't see him getting back into it. Well, that's good defending. Javier Hernandez. Substitution now for West Ham United. Gilfie Sigurdsson. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Now the countdown is to 10 minutes left. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. That's an excellent cross. Well, the cross doesn't get past the first man. Break quickly when they get possession. Bernard. Gilfie Sigurdsson. Unable to hold on to possession, Everton. Obia threads it through. Javier Hernandez. 
Good width in the attack. Should be. That is a high-class header to score here. Great power with the header. Excellently placed. Fine goal. Well, I've always been an admirer of good headers. And this was certainly one of those. A thumping effort. No slacking in these late minutes here. And the chance to extend their lead. And they have uh, voraciously gobbled up the chance. Well, they played some really good football out there today. And that was another example of it. West Ham want to make a change. And the referee's given the free kick. Just a change now. He's bringing on a new player. Gay. The referee has chosen to add on two extra minutes. Andre Gomez. Certainly wanting to find a teammate, but he's just found an opponent. West Ham have won it. They've won it in good style. Winning is such a joy, of course. The converse of that is the pain of defeat, and they're feeling that pain at the moment. Well, I don't think they can have any complaints. There weren't many in that team that uh, could claim to have had a decent game. Some final thoughts on one of the better performers today, Alan. Yeah, I mean, we thought he might be the danger man out there, Martin, didn't we? And that's how it turned out. Probably the difference between the two teams.